All right, you guys, DIY Raymond here with another video. Today, for at my Ford Ranger, it's got an 87 Boss 302 in it. Uh, so one of the things I gotta do is right here on the reservoir, it leaks. Uh, I didn't price for a new reservoir. This one here is connected also with the washer fluid. But um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this right here, JB Weld. This right here is real good, strong stuff. I highly recommend it. Um, I had used this on my lawnmower, my rider lawnmower, the same thing right here where the hose goes at. For my lawnmower to, to go for the gas, it ended up cracking. So I had gas leaking out. And, you know, gasoline eats to a lot of stuff. But I put the Ziggy Weld on there. I think I probably did maybe about two to three coats of this stuff. And it's worked perfect. Not leaked through yet. And I did that last year. I'll show y'all. Later on in another video, probably what it looks like, because it's locked up in the shed. Might get it out for this video, but um, for people that aren't familiar with taking these hoses off, what you do not want to do is when you're taking it off, do not do like this, because you will definitely crack it or even tear it off. So when you go to pull this off, just pull it straight out, and it will come out. So. uh yeah, go ahead and pause the video real quick while I situate this. I haven't even opened it yet. So, well, I ain't got to pause it, I don't think. I don't know. So, you got a little plate to mix it up on. All right, you guys, back. Um, so, all I did, if you never used this stuff before, <clears throat> once you take this little cap off right here, you just... Squeeze however much you need, squeeze it out. It'll come out two different colors. One side is white, the other side is black. You just take it and you mix it in. It gives you this little popsicle stick to go with it. And so then you just mix it up. Once you get it mixed in, you apply it to where you want it to go to. Now this stuff does dry fairly quick. So let's set this back up. And more likely what I'm going to have to do to get in there also is put it on my finger and do it. But that way you can get into the little nooks and crannies right here. Let that dry on there. And I'll come back a little bit later. If I do one more little coat. messy job but it'll go on pretty good all right so that's the video that's the other stuff that's on there all right i'm back uh, so that'll be the video for today or for this particular thing right here hopefully it's helpful to you guys and you know and let you know, you know the JB Weld. It is good for gasoline. It's good for good where you see it. It's not focusing. There we go. It's good for gasoline and everything. I mean, 
if you I want to say put it for your car gas tank but like a lawnmower not too bad it's pretty good it holds up it's real strong now uh, I'd recommend if you do use your hands for this to get you a glove and do it that way that means just take the glove off throw it away if not rinse off at the, at the water hose and then go inside and uh use so soap and hot water oops and you got to do it for a while because that's what i had to do just a little bit ago but y'all have a blessed day like subscribe to the channel and like us and like the video leave your comments below